Good morning. I'm Mike Headley, and with me is Zoe Headley, my trusted assistant. We're here to teach you about how to make a super green smoothie. A lot of people have trouble eating breakfast, and they don't eat anything, or they eat a candy bar or a cup of coffee and donut on the way to work. So I believe breakfast needs to be done right and if you get off to a good start with good nutrition in your body you can have a really good day so let's show them how to make a good smoothie okay mm -hmm. we're going to start with mostly organic ingredients and whole foods mm -hmm. we're going to start with some cinnamon so pour some cinnamon in there cinnamon is one of the highest antioxidants on the planet and so it makes it taste really good too put some turmeric turmeric is a uh, herb that is really high in antioxidants. Thank you, Zoe. We put something called Greens First. It has the equivalent of 15 servings of fruits and vegetables. It's all organic, tastes great. Put a big scoop of that in there, Zoe. I sprout mung beans and lentils. Sprouting activates the enzymes in the food. It makes it more nutritional. It has more nutritional value. For instance, you can soak mung beans or lentils for two days, drain them, rinse them in water once, and then put mesh over the top of the jar and let it sit out for two days, and they will grow sprouts, and that will become a live food, which is more nutritious. So I'm going to just, you can put a, a handful of those in there. Put some of those in there. Good job. All right, now we have some certified organic hemp protein powder. Mm -hmm. Put some protein in there. Put a big scoop of that in there. Now, wheatgrass is one of the highest alkalizing things we can put into our body. Yep. A lot of protein, a lot of nutritional value. Let's put some good wheatgrass in there. We don't get any wheatgrass in northern Minnesota at the health food stores and co-ops, so we just put the powder. We put some ground flax seeds, so shake some of that in there. Put a good amount of that in there. That's good. Yeah, that's a lot of good flax seed, a lot of good omega-3s. Yep. Dulse is a sea vegetable, a lot of minerals, and uh, very healthful, healthy for you. So we'll put a good amount of that in there. And now uh, the only thing we put in sweet is an apple, so you can put the apple in there, Zoe. We didn't add any vitamin C, so put a good squirt of vitamin D in there. Since we live in northern Minnesota, just squeeze the top of there. We don't get as much sun as, as we would like. All meals to maintain your insulin levels and energy levels need to have protein, carbohydrates, and fats. And so we want to add fats. People get so scared of fats these days, but good fats are good. And so this is um, organic coconut oil, very tasty. Gonna just shake it out. There. There. I'm gonna just have the rest of that. Mmm. Good stuff. More good fat is avocado, so I'll squeeze that in there. Okay, now we want to put lettuce. We put romaine lettuce, a good serving of romaine lettuce in there. The equivalent to maybe six or eight leaves. It's easy to get fruit. We eat bananas and apples and oranges and strawberries. Most people don't get enough greens. That's where we get a lot of alkalizing power for the body, a lot of vitamins and minerals. Yeah. I like spinach too. We wash the spinach. You need to pack that down in there. Good, Zoe. I also really like kale leaves and any other greens work. Okay. Excellent. We took about three, three or four minutes to, to clean everything and, and set it all, so it doesn't take a long time. Nope. We got everything? Now we just need to add some water. So pour that in there. Good job. There we go. There we go. I can put, this. put the lid on. You're such a good assistant. We should have our own cooking show. No. Very good. Now let's try it. See how it tastes. Yep. 
most times, I hear people when they make smoothies, they put dairy or yogurt in fruits, and it tastes really good. However, they're still missing the greens, and it has a lot of sugar, and we get a lot of sugar in our diets anyway. So help me pour this. So I, I drink two of these big glasses every morning, and then I'll put the rest in a thermos. I'll let you try some. Then I'll put this in a thermos to have for lunch. And a lot of people say, I need to eat something for breakfast. Well, I'll tell you, go ahead and eat. But have this first. You can have some oatmeal or cereal, or you can have a bagel or whatever you would like. Um... But this is, gives you the power pack nutrition, tastes good, kids will drink it. I'm, I'm going to have a sip. 